Hello everyone, today I am doing a vlog. It's a beautiful sunny day. It is 89 degrees, 11, 12 in the morning, and I am headed to a new restaurant. I'm meeting my friend CSG there. It's called Timeless. And I had seen an ad for this restaurant in a local magazine and it looked so cute. I wanted to go have a look. They have white painted, uh, decor inside it makes it really light and bright it just looks like a really cute charming place and now that it's summer and it has slowed down it's not as busy I thought it'd be a good time to go try out this restaurant and take you all along I will show you my outfit at the end of the video uh, I am wearing a lip color by 100% pure this is called Primrose. I think I have shown it to you all before because uh, I've, I've had this for a while. It's such a pretty color. What I did, I applied it with my, just with my finger, my little finger and then I blotted it, applied it again, and blotted it. And then I applied just a little bit of shea butter to give it kind of a, what would you call, like a sheer stain. And I really like the color, it's kind of coral. I'm wearing also foundation, blush, and mascara, and nothing on my eyelids. But I, I didn't have a coral colored cheek color like this so I combined a pink powder blush and a peach blush and made a coral. I tried to use this but I didn't I wasn't very successful it was all blotchy so I had to remove it and start all over again. I don't know what I did wrong. I usually have luck using lipsticks as blush but today it didn't work for some reason. Let's see we're not supposed to get rain, but it is summer, so just in case, I do have flip-flops. They're rubber, so they're waterproof. And I will take them in this canvas bag into the restaurant. I'm also carrying my salad dressing because it doesn't fit in my purse. So I put that all in my canvas bag, and if it's raining when we leave the restaurant, I can change out of my leather sandals. Yes, that's it. Um, all information about my makeup and my outfit and the restaurant where we're going, everything will be on the corresponding blog post on my blog. And that link to my blog will be down below. It will say all item links. If you're not a subscriber to my blog, I hope you'll consider subscribing because my subscribers find out firsthand when I post a new video, a new blog post, and I don't inundate your mailbox with emails um, at most two a week, and usually it's one or fewer a week. So just a thought, I would love for you to subscribe. I often talk about things on my blog, on the corresponding blog posts that I don't talk about in the video. Sometimes I get a little bit more personal. So that's it. I'm going to head to the restaurant now. I'd like to get there a little bit early before CSG so I can take some video. Hopefully there aren't that many people there yet. This morning when I was walking, I'm used to lizards scampering in front of me, but this morning it was one of those big green lizards. It's about this big and they walk on two legs like a person does. And they're so odd looking. I'm, I have to look them up. I'll put down below what they're called, but I'm wondering if they're exotics. Anybody from our area, do you know what those are called? And are they exotics, meaning not native, or are they native? They're really bright green. They're a beautiful lizard, but they're just so much bigger. They're like this big. And it's interesting, I, I keep seeing him in the same area. So he must live in this particular area. Or I guess two years later, the last time I saw him was about two years ago. So maybe this is not him. Maybe this is his great grandchild 
or her great-grandchild. I don't know how often lizards have babies, but it shocked me because I was not prepared for this little guy to run in front of me. He was so big. It feels like Naples is a little bit busier right now than it has been in the past, which I think is interesting. I know several of my friends who were snowbirds for the last 15, 20 years. Uh, one of my friends, plus she said one of her friends, they sold their home or at least their going to sell their home or something like that, but they're moving here full time. So maybe more and more people are doing that. It's still quieter though than season, which is why I love summer here. Not as much traffic, not as many people in the restaurants. So I was running errands in North Naples. I'm headed back to south, the southern part of Naples. This restaurant is around Central Avenue. I am here, it's 11.36, I'm meeting her at 11.45, so I think that's just perfect. I can quickly get some video. I have my hat, um, I also have my umbrella. In the summer, I have to have both. I'll put that in my bag also. My black bag. So now let's take some video. To look up what this is called. I love it when they train vines up a wall like this. Isn't this lovely? So let's have a look. I don't know if anybody eats outside if it's like already almost 90 degrees. So maybe maybe not. Thank you everyone for watching my video. I am headed home now. This is the name of the restaurant, Timeless, an MHK bakery or eatery. What made me think of bakery is next door is an adorable bakery that also serves lunch. So, <clears throat> excuse me, we decided we would come back there for lunch another day. So I thought I'll take you along when we do that also wonderful salad. I really just ordered lettuce and then had them add grilled shrimp and avocado and then I had my own dressing. It was delicious. It's 90 degrees, really warm, but it didn't rain so I didn't need my flip-flops. I'm headed home now. My outfit is coming up next and I will talk to you in my next video. Bye!